Morning everyone. Again, another fine day in paradise. I'm in the uh, Bull Town Market. I thought I'd uh, get up early for you lot. It's not something I normally do. <laughs> Try and avoid anyway. To be 100% honest, I think this is more of a local's market. Um, not really your kind of uh, touristy thing, the chicken, vegetables. Motorbikes piping up your ass. But yeah, definitely not. Uh, Holiday maker market. Well worth a visit. Anyway, if you want to pick up some goods, a lot of places around here are apartments, so people do their own cooking and everything and pick stuff up from the market really cheap. Um, yeah, you can actually just live out here it's so cheap if you buy your own stuff from the market every day. You have to do that. I mean, if there's only one of you, two of you. Probably just as well eating out. The restaurants are cheap anyway. Yeah, the vegetable departments. Butchery department. Mainly chicken. Loads of chicken going on. Pork. Beef. Yeah, so this is the butchery section. You know, they don't have any um, fridges or anything here. But they still seem to continue quite gracefully. Nice bit of liver there. I don't know how they do it. But, yeah, I'm going to get out of here because it doesn't stink too healthy. It doesn't smell too healthy. I'm going to go see the fish place. Check out the fish restaurant. But yeah, all this meat, bearing in mind it is around 30 degrees. And all this meat is just sitting around. I don't know how they get away with it. But they do. That's how you, uh, that's what you do in uh, these hot countries. I guess they sell it so fast, it's so fresh. Fish market going on there. Butchery section goes into the fish market. Big on their prawns and snails here. Razor clams, squid, tuna, yellow striped fish, some specification. Yeah, as I say, it's like all fresh, caught this morning and it'll probably all be sold by the end of the day anyway. So, they, you know, they, they have a tendency just to do fresh stuff. They, anything left over at the end of the day, they tend to either throw away, or in case of fish, they'll probably use it as um, rubby dubby, or to put in the lobster pots, etc., etc. Generally speaking, yeah, although it's not refrigerated, it is pulled fresh every morning and normally sold by the end of the day. This is the seafood market in Hung Tao. Loads of different dried fish going on here. You even have a little oh, baby crabs look. Little baby crabs. Squid. Fresh squid, freshly caught. The lot is still being kept alive. Very running water. Big on their snails here. Look at that. Look how crab's still alive. Look, that's how fresh it is. All this stuff is absolutely fresh. Straight in the pot, straight to the table. Oh. 
Look at this array of fresh fish. Honest, if you had a restaurant or you live here, this is the ideal place to get your fish. I mean, look at that. I wouldn't even have a clue where to start. Um, yeah, maybe some tuna there. Some parrotfish, red snapper. A bit of everything going on there. Amazing. These are hard people at work, filleting it. And coming onto your shells. Oysters, look at that. Massive oysters. I don't think I've ever seen oysters that big. Whether these are farmed or fresh, I'm not quite sure. Look at the size of those squid. Well, cuttlefish actually. That's uh, octopus. Oh my god, look at them clams. Just massive. Yeah, such a wide selection of fish here. Seafood, shellfish, prawns. Yeah, everything you want for that perfect seafood meal. It's just buzzling here with so much seafood, so much fresh food. If, you're, if you like your seafood, then this is definitely the place you need to visit. Especially if you live here or you've got an apartment here or you know, you've got cooking facilities here. Just an absolute mixture of all kinds of seafood. Absolutely amazing, look at that. Different types of crabs, shellfish. Yeah, I mean, for a seafood lover, this is paradise, absolute paradise. And it's all fresh. It's, you know, a lot of these fish markets you go to, there's a horrible stench in the air. But here, no, all you can smell is fresh fish. That's how fresh it is. Still running around, still alive, kicking. Look at all those calamaris, cuttlefish, squid. The size of those prawns, well, half a dozen of them, just pan fried with a bit of garlic, ginger, thanks, what you want? Oysters, crabs, more shellfish. So much going on here. As I say, if you're a seafood lover, then this is definitely the place you need to be. Look at these snails, big on their snails, really big on their snails in Vietnam. Crabs. I mean, that is just a mountain of oysters. And look at the size of it. They're all fresh. You get different types of snails, clams, prawns. Oh my god. I'm actually feeling hungry. I wish I had somewhere to put some stuff. And I'd be, uh, I'd be in my element. If you think about opening a seafood restaurant here, you couldn't go far wrong using this as your main area. Look at these fish. Angel fish. Even got some rays there. Again, more oysters. Small ones, large ones. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Oh my god, they're all so fresh. Some giant snails there. They are like whelks, but probably about twice the size, three times the size. Lobsters, yeah. all being kept fresh in water. This is absolutely amazing. As I say, it all smells fresh. There's nothing, hasn't got that horrible fish smell, rotten fish and stuff. Vung Tao Market, you get all your clothes here. different types of cloths if you want to make things yourself. Beautiful colours here, look at it. Ooh, so colourful. Yeah, if you want to make your own dresses or tablecloths or whatever, you can get all your stuff here. Yeah, quite a big market. You know, from food, clothes, cloth. 
bit of jewellery as well. Look at that. Gold is cheap here. Good quality as well, apparently. So yeah, this is Boomtown Market. I've come down here this morning just to have a little look around and uh, show you what basic life living, living life basically is all about. And you can come here and get all your fresh vegetables, fresh fish, fresh meat, everything you need. This market's open daily and uh, all the locals come here, all the expats come here, buy all their stuff and uh, cook it at home because most of the people here live in apartments with cooking facilities so it's well worth coming down here and getting all your stuff uh, rather than eating out every night although it's cheap to eat out every night you can get a bowl of soup for a pound and things like that um, it's even cheaper if you buy your own stuff and cook it at home so anyway there you go boom towel market if you are staying for a little while get an apartment and definitely the place to come get here early in the morning everything's more fresh obviously the later in the day you leave it the longer it's been hanging about and uh, yeah you don't really want that especially not with fish and meat but all your different kinds of fruit and veg lemons limes and you've also got all your um, kitchen equipment and bathroom equipment and everything else you possibly need. Household goods, mats, carpets, crockery, cups, sauces, everything you need is here in the Vungtau market jewellery section as well if you want to buy yourself a buy the missus a necklace clothes yeah I've got to be honest it doesn't smell too healthy in here oh hello oh, hello <laughs> doesn't smell too healthy in here but as to be expected with all that fresh fish and uh, meat hanging about in the heat and a selection of food here that you can buy in the market typical as soon as I start filming someone will stand in front of it there you go nice selection of uh, food you can get from the market some prawns sorry. pork chicken vegetables yeah there's a say there's no refrigeration here um, it's basically just uh, cooked to order not fresh cooked to order but heat it up whatever you want good morning everyone I am in Boomtown Market um, yeah I thought it'd be rude not to have someone to eat here, but to be honest with you, I'm not too happy about it. Well, I'll grab myself some uh, little knickknacks here, some prawns, some pork, some kingfish, some vegetables, and some rice. Uh, yeah, prawns with a boiled egg, that's breakfast today. I'm gonna be 100% honest with you. I've eaten some dodgy places and uh, I have fortunately got a very strong stomach but I thought I'd stop here and have something to eat just for the hell of it because it is the marketplace but to be honest with you I'm not 100% too happy about it I've got some pork again messing around with these chopsticks is not my thing a bit of pork there vegetables they got to what they are bit of fresh 
grab a prawn. Grab my prawns. about this because it's not a big deal. I've just seen the biggest rat I've ever seen in my life run across here and hide in here. In fact, it's that big. I actually, I actually thought it was a cat at first. Unbelievable. Come on. Come on. Come on, little ratty. Well, I'm in Vung Tao street restaurant market sort of thing. Um, I just had myself, I pecked at something to eat. I didn't actually eat all of it, but I'll be 100% honest with you. If um, if this was the UK, uh, within five hours, they'd have a massive skip outside. Health and safety would be down here. The police would be going over this place literally pick everything up and just chuck it in a skip out the front <laughs> that's the health and safety standards level here um, to be honest with you i'm not going to put it down because i wouldn't have it any other way i'm in vietnam for christ's sake this is what they do this is the life in vietnam and uh it's beautiful and i certainly would not have it any other way this is what the, this is how vietnamese people live this is what they're used to you know, there isn't a single refrigerator around here. There's not one fridge around here. All the food is just basically cooked and left sitting there and served up. But Vung Tao Market, yeah. Grab some of the wheat, try it for yourselves. Make sure you put the toilet paper in the fridge and got a strong stomach as well. Uh, <laughs> generally speaking, it's Vietnam and I'm happy to be here. And I love it the way it is and I hope it doesn't change.